today I'm going to be filming an Urban Outfitters try on haul. I haven't done a clothing haul in so long so I thought it's about time to do some fashion related videos on my channel. So I picked out a lot of bits for spring and summer. I'll have all the links to everything I show you in this video down in the description so if you guys like any piece then you can definitely go ahead and check it out on their website. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already and if you would like to follow me on any of my social media my Twitter, Instagram and Snapchat are all Roxora same way it's spelled here. But without further ado let's just jump right into the video. So I've got everything in a massive pile just down there so I'm just going to pick out bits that I see in no particular order. So the first thing I picked up from Urban Outfitters is actually the wrong way round. I'm not prepared for this video. So the first thing I picked up from Urban Outfitters is this really cute turtleneck. I actually got two different turtlenecks. This one is like this ribbed kind of texture and it's this gorgeous peachy and kind of dusky rose colour which is so on trend right now and I just love the feel of this material. It's really really nice and soft and you guys see me wearing turtlenecks pretty much like every day of my life and Urban Outfitters has a lot of choice for turtlenecks so I feel like they're a good website to kind of stock up on your turtlenecks. And this one is also ribbed but it's made from this slightly different material and it looks like this it's light blue and yeah this is what it looks like I really love these kind of colors like these pastel um, pinks and blues because I feel like they're just a really nice switch up from my like regular black wardrobe the next thing I picked up is this like sweater jumper thing and this is from the brand BDG and it's a really nice dusky rose colour. Do you guys see a recurring theme yet? I don't know, I've just been really loving these really pinky and light shades of colour recently. I'm not usually the type of girl to like pinks. I used to hate the colour pink for some reason, but now it's really growing on me. And yeah, so this is just like one of those jumpers that you can throw on when you're having a lazy day in and it's just really like easy, stylish and comfortable. So perfect combo. So this next piece is something really, really cute that I feel like a lot of you guys will love. But for me, I've never worn anything like this before so it's quite out of my comfort zone but I'm willing to give it a go and it's this really cute um, dungaree style dress it looks like this again it's a dusky rose color but like I said I've just been loving this color a lot and it's got cute little zips on the side so you can like put your phone in if you want I think this paired with a turtleneck will just look so cute the next thing I picked up from their website is this really cute wide brimmed hat. I think hats like this are so cute. I kind of feel like a witch from American Horror Story Coven wearing this hat, but that's totally okay with me. Yeah, it's just a really, really simple thing, but I feel like it can really dress up your outfit a lot. The next thing I got is this grey ribbed body. It goes all the way down and it's got a really nice cutout at the back, which is a nice little addition. I like that it's not too low neck, you know what I mean? Like, it's still pretty wearable and you can just chuck anything over the top of this, um, maybe like a sheer shirt or something. And it'll just look really, really cute. This perhaps will be more suitable for the summer, but I still picked it up because I really liked it. The next thing I picked up is this backpack. I thought this was so cute. It's really like minimalistic and it's black and it's got like gold details, which are two of my favorite things combined. It's quite spacious. I just felt like I wanted a backpack for like the spring and summer seasons just because if I'm running about or like going to to festivals or like picnics then I think this is a good option rather than carrying a handbag around. The next thing is a cardigan and this is a really nice soft knit cardigan. It's quite thin. It's not too long which is always great. It's got that really slouchy feel to it which I really like so I feel like throwing this over the top on like colder spring or summer days will just be great. The next thing I picked up is this top from Silence and Noise. It looks like this. It's like a grey kind of slouchy top it's got this cross um, over detailing in the front here and it's got a little like slit down the middle which isn't like too revealing I feel like it's still quite wearable this is kind of creased I'm gonna have to iron it so sorry about that guys but this looked really nice on the model on the website so I thought I might as well just try it out and see if it suits me next thing I picked up is this little black crop top it's off the shoulders and it's got like half length sleeves which I think is really flattering and the off the shoulders cut is really feminine and I really like it and it's quite stretchy as well so I'm pretty sure this could fit a lot of different sizes even though it's a size S. The next thing I picked up is this little crop top which is like striped and the stripes are navy and white and this is again from BDG. BDG are literally killing it. When I saw this on the website I thought this is a dungaree top. I feel like it might even work with the dungaree dress that I showed you earlier but I'm not sure if the colours will go so I have to try that out. I then also picked up some black shorts and I've never had 
black high-waisted shorts, believe it or not. I've always had like denim ones, but never black, and I've always wanted some. So I picked these up, and these are from the brand Dr. Denim Jeans Makers. They look like this, they're just really simple. I feel like they will look really cool with Doc Martens. These look quite big though. I don't know if they'll fit me, but we'll see. Um, I'm usually quite small around the butt region, but they might fit me alright, I'm not sure. Next, I also picked up this Calvin Klein tank top. This is a really simple Calvin Klein design, but I think it's quite cute anyway. It is quite see-through, so I recommend wearing a sports bra underneath this. But apart from that, it's really great. Um, the material is really soft, but I feel like this is a really cool and casual stable piece for my wardrobe. I then also picked up one of these Calvin Klein sports bras. A lot of people have been saying that they're really comfortable, so I wanted to pick one up myself and try it out. And I think it's just a really cute, simple design. These are really on trend at the moment, so I gave into the hype. Hashtag my Calvins. The next thing I picked up is this leather style jacket, and this is by the brand Sparkle and Fade. It's like a matte black, so it's not like a shiny leather, it's a matte leather. This is obviously faux leather, and I love the feel of it. It's really, really nice, it's a nice fit. And until now, I've gotta say, I've never had the perfect black leather jacket. This is probably one of my favorite things that I picked up from Urban Outfitters. The next thing is this Urban Outfitters Renewal jacket. I just really love how grungy it looks. I feel like it'll be great for spring and summer. Summer, just to throw over the top of anything for like the colder days. It's just really really cute. Again, I think this will look amazing with my Doc Martens, so I picked it up. The next thing I picked up are some shades, and these are what they look like. These are so so nice, and they've got like this silver band around the top, which is a nice little detail. And they're like this creamy white color, almost clear, which I've never actually had glasses like this before. What do you guys think? Do they suit me? I really love them, they're so precious. We're now coming close to the end. I've got two more items to show you, and they're both shoes. In the past, I've realized I don't actually have a lot of pairs of shoes, and it's the same with trousers and shoes. I don't really know why. It seems like I always buy tops, but always forget about the bottoms. So I picked up some Chelsea boots from Urban Outfitters, and these are so, so gorgeous. These are just the Urban Outfitters own brand, and they are amazing. I've been wearing these like every day. These are so classic and really stylish and they're really comfortable actually. I feel like you have to break them in first but once you do they're really comfortable. I've been wearing these like every day. And then lastly I've also picked up some Converse. Converse are one of my favourite shoes to wear around spring and summer, especially summer because they're just so cute, really comfortable and they look amazing with high waisted shorts. So that is all for my Urban Outfits try on haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this type of video. Let me know because I'm always really cautious about filming different types of videos. So I'm trying something a little bit different for my channel and I hope you guys enjoy it. If you do, don't forget to give me a thumbs up so I know. And subscribe if you're not already. The subscribe button is just down below. So like, I don't know, like maybe you could click it. If you guys want to follow me on any of my social media, my Twitter, Instagram and Snapchat are all Roxaurus. Same way it's spelled here. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye!